Hey, what's going on guys, Mega Balls here today and welcome to some more Black Ops 3 beta gameplay. This time I'm using some Razorback. Do you know what that is? That's a submachine gun and it is a monster. Just throwing it out there. But before I start talking about this gameplay, this will be my last Black Ops 3 beta gameplay. I've had no internet to actually record gameplay, so it's been a struggle to actually get it. I've had to, because I've been moving house as well, I've had no time to actually make the videos, but I have mentioned this in previous videos, guys, so I apologize for not having so much Black Ops 3 beta gameplay for you to watch, but it came out at the wrong time, unfortunately. I have been uh, around with my brothers, I have got some gameplay on his account with his setup, so it's not my gameplay that you're going to be seeing in the feed, but it is me playing, are you sure you don't worry about that? The quality is still bad, guys. And I, uh, I apologise for the bad quality again, but as I said in other previous videos, the laptop, yeah, you don't need to know again. Um, but yeah, anyways guys, still before this gameplay, uh, I'm also going to i55, so if you want me to vlog that, then I will. Just let me know in the comments or on Twitter, but it has to be soon because I'm going on the 29th and the 30th of August, so it will be tomorrow when this video is released. That's everything I want to talk about before the gameplay guys, but let's move on to the gameplay and yeah, like I said, I'm using some Razorback SMG and this gun is an animal, pure animal and um, that's what it wants to be anyway because what I mean by that is if the connections are good and on your side, then this gun will tear through people. It's got good damage from close range and long range shots, especially with long barrel, that is a key key attachment that you need to put on the Razorback. It's got low recoil, like literally next to none, and it's got great iron sights. So, in theory this weapon is such a good weapon, but it can be the total opposite when the connections are bad. Because I found myself hitting so many hit markers from close quarters and from long range. So, it's going to be one of those games where if the connections are bad, you will do bad. Uh, so, Hopefully you get host, because connection is always, you know, your connection with host, but anyways. This weapon actually kind of reminds me of the FAMAS when it was fully auto. I don't know what, I think it was in Black Ops 1 where that was a fully automatic weapon. Can't quite remember. Uh, but I saw a lot of people actually using this weapon on multiplayer. And it does actually seem like the go-to gun. So, like, if you're doing bad with your Man of War assault rifle, you'd pull this some machine gun out and start tearing shit up. It's just like the ASM one like you used to do on Advanced Warfare. But like I said guys, this weapon is only good when it's good connection. I can't stress that enough. Bad connection, bad weapon. That's my opinion on it. If you don't agree with my opinion then obviously leave it in the comments. We'll all have feedback and we'll have a discussion about it. Um, but anyways guys, because I haven't got a lot to say about the Razorback because I've only used it for around five to six games so I can't say too much about this weapon only what I've seen while playing with it but it is only a beta and a lot can change from now till the release you know they could nerf it they could buff it whatever they could do what they want with it I can't see myself playing with this weapon when the game is released because I don't think they're going to get rid of the weapon um, you know it's just a lot of people have been using it and they won't get rid of it but Anyways guys, this is going to be the end of the video, hope you enjoyed this video, then if you have, then please hit that like button, it really does help my channel grow. Also, please be sure to subscribe if you're new to keep up to date with any of my future videos or my previous videos. And yeah guys, that is it. No more Black Ops 3 till the release, so hopefully you don't miss it too much, the people that watch my videos, but as always guys, it's been a pleasure and... Adiós.